So with, with, with kids being placed in those unenviable positions, going forward, what's the best possible scenario for a young man? Maybe you're 19, maybe you're 20, and you're going in college or you're finishing your first year of college, and you have these guys around you. And like you say, you're responsible. You know your mom lights or whatever, and that Pell Grant may not be enough. But you, we see the numbers that they're putting out at Louisville, 100, at Arizona, 100, at uh, NC State, 73, at Seton Hall, 30, 38,000. You know, for me and you growing up, that's a lot of money. That's about two, three years of money right there. So, so what's, what do we do to help these young guys be armed and help the parents, you know, shield and protect their kids from being vulnerable? Uh, uh. Here we go. Which is very hard just to say no, man. Where that strength has come to, from, Mark? That's some strength. It has, it has to be inner strength. It has to come from your parents. It has to come from somebody on the outside that you that you really trust. Um, it could come from an uncle. It can come from a friend. Man, no, I ain't letting you do that. Mm -hmm. I mean, just just imagine, just imagine this, and, and, and it happens. A lot of these athletes got boys who work in the street. Yes. Or if not, just work. When I was coming up. Those are the people that protect you. Yeah. They ain't let nobody else from the outside come in and do. I don't care how much money they have. Mm -hmm. No, nah, man. You know, but today it's not like that because everybody wants to ride your coattail. Yes. So they'll let somebody come in and do those things. But they, you know, they look for them. Yeah. But again, your you gotta, boys go out and look for those guys. But you have to have the fortitude. You have to have the fortitude to want to say no, and it's the hardest thing to do nowadays because we make it so much easier with everything you see to say yeah man no it's too it's too hard out here is it that hard is it that hard to really think about it is it really that hard i would argue it's almost too easy because you know these guys they do get paid now if you're at a mid like even in the mac rider and mama for them they paying stipends yeah. towson Pays a stipend. So if you get a Pell Grant, that's six. If they give you a stipend, that's another five, six, maybe seven or eight. And then the meal money on the road, you don't have to spend all of that. If you live in an apartment, you and your homie both get a thousand a month, but the rent is eight hundred a month. You know, I mean, these guys are walking around. Every kid I talk to, and I ask them to really think about it, and they'll tell you anywhere from a thousand to two thousand a month that they're clearing in their pocket while they're playing basketball and you pay no taxes. So why should you want more? That's because society says that. Society yes. they don't they don't tell you straight up and straight down that you have to have more. No. They show you the beats. Yes. They show you the Jordans. The cars. They show you the cars, but they show you they show you the LeBron with the hoodie on. They show you all that. They make you they they, they make let me not say you, they make us mm -hmm. do what we've been always doing. Being consumers, mm -hmm. wanting to have more, mm -hmm. wanting to be more, lusting to be more. And we're just talking about the images of it, not the reality of it. Because mm -hmm. the reality is, when you start doing it, you want more, you're going to find yourself, that 2000 going to be like, it's never enough. It's going to be 150 yeah. It's going to be $150. Because as soon as you get the two grand after you clear all your bills, you're going to do what I was doing. You're going to be down at the gallery every day. <laughs> <laughs> and some young lady going to be, be coursing you, coursing you to come in the trends too. You see what I'm saying? And, and you're going to be like, ah, and you're going to be floating. You are fulfilling. You know, they're, they're going to be coursing you to come in the trends too. And and you got to have my deal. Man, I got this 850 because that's what my pilgrim was at the time. It was 850. Mm -hmm. But that was for the semester. It wasn't for a month. Mm -hmm. So I had to figure out. What I'm gonna do with this money? First thing I do, I make sure I got money. If I gotta go home, mm -hmm. I put that away. I know I gotta have two dollars and fifty cents every night for some chicken wings and fries. Mm -hmm. So that's a must because every night I'm having my chicken wings and fries, my four wings and fries. I'm gonna have every night. <laughs> that's two dollars and fifty cents. So I gotta think about. You think about the week. Mm -hmm. uh, 
okay, you wanna act trife and flip the script Would you wonder why my drama slash comma Riff that you're kicking like Pele Flows, even bonos, my versatility Capability is simply bougie Why took the OU?